What's up everyone, Lion Roar here, and we've got a war against UKR Love Family. Let's get some one shots. But first, join me over in Gemstone Legends. Most of the OG players who got in early on Empires and Puzzles are already over here because we know it's players who get in early on games like this who are at the biggest advantage. Not only will you help support the channel by using the link in the description of this video, but if you use the code hashtag lion underscore 2021 hashtag, you will get a free epic hero named Elidor along with five more gold scrolls and a bunch of gems and gold coins. Then you'll be able to participate in beginner events to get another free epic hero named Soliana, a bunch of legendary equipment, and a platinum scroll which will give you another free epic or legendary hero. Guys, wow. Just be sure to use the code within 3 hours of downloading the game and after completing the tutorial. And I will see you in Gemstone Legends. Okay, for this war we have War Equalizer, which means that all the buffs and uh, uh, effects, status ailments, they go away every 3 turns. So I'm going to um, still have to use a lot of heroes that have status ailments and things just because I've leveled up so many of them. Uh, but I do have them all kind of stacked on one team, so you, it, they're still usable, you just have to play around them, and I think you get the benefit on offense, where you get to choose when to fire them, the defense doesn't get to choose when to fire it, but uh, the timing is better for the defense, um, so uh, I am going to take on this team here because it has more status ailments than uh, the others around with defense down, and um, we got some flames from Gravemaker, and uh, we got the attack down from Richard here, so those are things that we can potentially clean up. I'm going to use Lady Loki, Gravemaker, Tyr, Lord Loki, and Ariel. Here we go. Alright, so this is all going to be dependent on getting... Well, two reds will set off one hero here, Gravemaker. But generally, I need three red matches to win. And it just all depends on if I'm going to get that in time. Yeah, that's going to be a real pain. Well, let's line up the... Uh, let's line up the third red here. That was nice. Alright, so now I'm healed up. Do I really want to even use any of these? Probably not, right? Because the uh, cleanse is about to happen. I'm just going to ghost. <laughs> see here. I don't need to use my Lady Loki yet. She's still alive. Her minions are just so sneaky good. 
All right, there's one down. Um, let's look for another one. Maybe we can find another costume Vivica that does defense down. Um, or just another hero that does defense down because I do have a good team against that. Um, so just looking around, looking around. I kind of want them to be on the flank. Um, I see lots of the regular Vivicas. This one does defense down. I do think this one's a risky one to take my boomer bust team against, but let's do it. I think it's the best matched, um, but this is why it's called the boomer bust team. Either it's going to win in dominating fashion or <laughs> I'm barely going to get any points. But we'll find out here. Let's do this. All right, we got some purple, which is good. I have one in five chance of making a red diamond. And that might be worth it. Well, it's not a red diamond, but could be worse. Hmm. Just need one more red match. There we go. And this, this part feels good. I don't want them to get minions. There we go. All right, thank you, Boomer Bus team. That was a boom. All right, moving on, we're going to uh, take a, a yellow heavy team. Yeah, let's take a yellow heavy team, but I don't want to go against Ursina, obviously. Let's see if they have another purple flank. This one might be good down here. Um, yeah, why not? Why not? All right. Um, this is a funny team. Okay, yeah, let's take Delilah there. June White Rabbit. Let's put the 11 troop on June. All right, here we go. This team's a little bit fragile that I'm taking. Uh, it has a couple of heroes with pretty low defense for five star heroes. Um, so I've got to, I've got to try and, uh, be really aggressive. Hmm. Let's see if we can get some more reds to come up from the bottom. I'm going to try and bunch these yellows and reds. Uh, there we go. There we go. Here's one of my favorite things about Guardian Kong and Ghost Box Him. He is a random cleanser. <laughs> I think I want to try and get rid of Jabber. He's not going to die, is he?
His mana's gonna take a while. Let's let's try to do this efficiently. Oh man, Finley's gonna go off, isn't he? At least he's, uh, I was gonna say, at least he's, there's a chance he only hits one. Um, I should be able to kill him with the tiles. Let's just go after Finley. Fantastic. All right. Next up, I have a green heavy team. Where are their blue flanks? And it dispels a lot, so this might be a good team to take on. Yeah, that might be a really good team to take on. There's a lot to dispel there. Just taking a look around before I commit. There's another relatively good one, but I think that this one... This one's a pretty good matchup. We're going to take Kingston, Ratatusker, Evelyn. Mm, let's put Sashat there and Sartana there. All right. Bring it. Okay, okay, okay. I'd be more comfortable if there were more greens on board. We can set up a purple match, and I have another purple match over there. Oh, this is good. Oh, I thought I was going to get a purple diamond out of that. Oh, well. Hmm. Should I use the shot or not? Do you think the tiles will just kill her? These only last for three turns. It is gonna uh, make it disappear in a turn too. So I'll just wait. You know what? She's gonna be easier to kill. I'm just going after her. All right, now we just got a ghost to the win. So, so far four for four, we got two teams left. Um, this is another green heavy team. And I wanna go against a team that has a lot of area of effect because I can do a lot of dodging. So this might be a good team down here. 
Um, there's a couple heroes anyway that do area of effect. Taking uh, going against an Ursina team might be good too. Uh, this this might be a really good team actually for it because there's so much area of effect there. Um, just looking around, at all the, the there's another good one. That's actually a really good one. Um, yeah, well. Let's try this one. We'll go costume Liana. Costume Caitlyn, Evelyn. I just love the costumes, Caitlyn and Liana. Like, not only are they good heroes, but the art is amazing. I love the art on those two. <laughs> All right, let's put a crit troop on just because I don't know. I think the defense is better that way. Okay. All right, we can do a little cascade. I don't see enough green for my liking yet. I wonder if we can get more to come on the board. It's not enough purple yet either, so let's cascade. This, unfortunately, is... It's not feeling good. We'll see what happens. Scotty's going to go off here. Well. Oh, please don't die. Oh, man, but... That thing is going to go off. I guess I have to save Rigard. I want to make the green dragon bomb so bad, but I don't want to hit Scotty. I might be hitting her anyway. She's going to kill like Evelyn and Sasha at least. Oh, Evelyn lived. like I dodged a bullet here. Oh no, don't set off Scotty again. Oh, so close. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. And that's five of five. All right. Man, that wasn't looking good for a moment. That was not looking good for a moment. Okay, so this is a bonus round. You know, when I go five of five, I have a cleanup team left, but um, should probably go for another one shot if I can. Uh, and what heroes do I have left? Yeah, 
Um, I've got good blues and yellows. I like taking a like a good yellow team, I think. I need to pick a really I don't know, a team that I think I can beat with this. Um, it's not going to be the strongest team I have here. So, maybe one with status ailments, because I think, um, I don't know. This is a tough choice, actually, coming down to the wire here. This is, this is maybe a good team for this. Yeah. Let's do June, Melosi, Vivica, and then we can do two more. Let's do like, yeah, Krampus and Alice. That looks good. Let's give Vivica the big mana troop. We'll give the level 11 to Melosi and don't want to cleanse? Probably. I'll probably just leave the regular Vivica up instead of the costume. She still gets the bonus for having the costume leveled. All right, here we go. All right, come on, board. Give me one more good board. I like that start. <laughs> So it doesn't really make sense to use Krampus yet. I should wait a turn. Yeah, let's wait a turn. Although, <laughs> should have used Alice, I don't know what I'm thinking. This is looking good. I just wanted to wait one more turn um, for June to get one bit closer and then Melosi's effect will stick after the cleansing part of the war goes off. Don't kill June. All right. All right, six for six. I will take that every day. Fantastic, fantastic. And how many hits do we have left? We have 32 left. They have a bunch left. All right, let's see what they can do. Um, so far, I'm on top. Oh, look at that. In the battle of Lion Roar and Mr. Spock, we are tied. We are tied. <laughs> All right, well, somehow it put me in number one. So um, take that, Mr. Spock. <laughs> All right. Well, everyone, if you enjoy videos like this, please consider giving the video a like. And if you're not already subscribed, please consider doing that as well. Hitting the bell notification so you know when I go live or drop more of these. And I will catch you in the next one.